early, but we're away for your actual birthday. Yeah. So. I don't really know what we're doing, and then we're going to London. I don't know where we're staying. So it'll be a surprise for you guys, as it is for them. It's not much. Yeah. Um, it's nice to be out again. So obviously our last vlogs were in Disney World. Um, <laughs> and we are on a train. <laughs> we are. So yeah, we are travelling from New York North Gate yeah, yeah, not at all. to King's Cross. Um, included in the first class ticket. The not breakfast time now. It's now lunch time. No, ten past five. Ten past five. So quirky. Wow. <laughs> and that is the, uh, Palace Theatre. The Palace Theatre, yeah, you can just see the moon eye. Oh, yeah. Right in the background there. Nice little feature to have. And obviously, what do they show at Palace Theatre? They show Harry Potter and the Cursed Child. That's interesting. It's just a happy incident. How did this happen? I don't know. <laughs> you can probably hear there's a lot of pigeons around. London pigeons. It's the 
the view from the other side. Very nice views up here. Yes. It's nice that it's a, a lovely evening. Yeah. Well, nice. In the sun setting over beautiful London. Should we call up our room? I think we should. Find it. What number are we? Uh, we are 401. 401. This way? Is it? Yeah. Ah. Thank you. Through this way. Uh -huh. And we are through this little door here, 401 and 402. Okay, your key card. We've got two. Uh -huh. Yeah. Cute little room. The aircon unit. TV. Oh, I didn't even notice that was a TV. Oh. Somebody got something organised. <laughs> Happy birthday. Early birthday. Early birthday. Very, early, very, still, it's yeah, a birthday treat. A few months early. <laughs> good views of the Palace Theatre. Really good views. You got a nice double bed. Yep. Got a reading room. Yeah. Oh. Good. The lighting around the top. And half the uh, bedroom is a kind of wet room. Yeah, oh. isn't it a wet room, I suppose? Just slide a glass door. Slide a door. Get a glass of water provided. Oh, yeah. Bedside table. And your commode. What you heard? Toilet. <laughs> your sink. And your walk in shower. Yeah. So it's it's just compact, a... but it's what you need. Yeah. It's got everything you need, which is really good. Nicer than a Airbnb we've stayed in. Yeah. Much nicer. That's pretty firm. Yeah. Pretty firm, fair enough to say. I'm intrigued to see what it's going to be like. Noise wise, later. Hmm. See, we are set, we're in central Soho, in a sense. Um, so they have these dotted around. They've got one in Covent Garden and one in Holborn. Is that how I say it? And then this one here. Um, but when I booked it, I didn't I didn't know how close it was to the Palace Theatre at all. There's, oh, don't pop the balloons! <laughs> That's just the balloons. <laughs> Mary Poppins is just around the corner. Oh, is it? Yeah, being shown. So as you can see, it's Harry Potter and the Cursed Child. What's the last show in, I wonder? What time is it now? 7 o'clock. Probably mm. 7. Or maybe 8, but it'd be the Friday, I don't know. When we came in, there was quite a lot of people yeah. queued to go in. So as you can see, it's empty now. <laughs> yeah, these balloons are yeah, sticking. Yeah, for um, when I booked it, it said, was there any special requests? And I just put early birthday treat. Um, but yeah, really nice. Cool. Nice little touch there. I didn't have to do that. Thank you very much. <laughs> to you and the Soho team. Yeah. But yeah, looking forward very to excited. trying out the everything really. Yeah. They've got their own perfect mugs as well, a twining tea, little kettle. So we've not got breakfast. No, but there is a restaurant downstairs. It looked really nice, actually. What do you say? Was it Five pound each per breakfast. It's not too bad. Which isn't bad, but when you're in London, there's plenty of places. For oh yes, <laughs> there is. So I didn't book breakfast, but you said we could book it on. Okay. Um, but we'll, yeah, it should, I don't know. We're gonna just explore. We've got a reservation um, at nine o'clock for tea, for late tea. The closest tube is Leicester. Uh, what is it, Leicester Square Station? I don't know, Leicester Tube, I don't know which one it is. Um, but then the next one's Covent Garden, then Holden, and then back to King's Cross, so it's all on a really good straight line. Really easy connections. Yeah. How long were you take was on the tube for? Six minutes, if that's. Really? Ten. Yeah, about ten, ten minutes. To get here from, from King's Cross to here, walking as well, went through Chinatown. 
Um, you was trying to find the sat now. I got lost. I'm not good with technology. <laughs> it's only my job. But we're here. We're here. We're settled. Um, go and pack a little bit now. Explore a bit of the hotel. Yeah, I think so. Explore a little bit around here. Just, yeah. See what's about. Yeah. Exciting. Love London. <laughs> We are dining at the Leicester Square Kitchen, which I think is part of, is it, I think it's the Mercer Blue Hotel, oh no, the Ham something Ham Hotel, Hampson, Hampshire, Hampshire, Hampshire. <laughs> so yeah, so I've been here before, but a few years ago, but Josh hasn't been here and I really wanted to try it, so let's go in and see what it's like, it's just next to the Odeon as well. Looks like they have the outdoor seating in the summertime with the heaters. Yeah, I feel like it was summer when I last came and they did. Yeah, let's go in and enjoy. Our first entree has arrived, so we went for the spicy nachos and the guacamole. Good portion. Yeah, it's really good. And we're at the, I keep forgetting, Leicester Square. Leicester Square Kitchen. Yeah. Pretty cool. We're just going to wait for our cocktail to arrive as well. Let's tuck in. Good. <laughs> it's so fresh. It's really tasty. Yeah. Good. Tuck in. Our cocktails have just arrived, so I've gone for the lavender fizz, the prosecco, lavender, and I can't remember what else was in it. Uh, I'll have a look in a second. And then Josh has gone for the Smoky Jones. Smoky Jones. Uh, tequila, like a jalapeno syrup. Okay. Uh, salt on the edge. Looking good. Some kind of more chili. <laughs> I'm not sure that's it. Chili on there. That's a chili, huh? Scary. Yeah? Wow. That's nice. <laughs> mm, you taste the tequila, but it's just really smooth. Nice. Mm. Yeah, really good. Oh, it tastes like spring in a cup. Yeah? Yeah, really nice. It smells incredible as well. Really? Very nice, yeah. Fruity. Yeah, so it was... Oh, it's a tequila. Tequila, lavender syrup, lime, raspberry, and prosecco. Nice. We've now got the tiger prawns just here with chili mayonnaise, I think it was, and calamari with a tequila mayonnaise. Okay. Yum, yum, yum. Our last bit of food, we've got the uh, sliders with cheese, jalapeno, cheese, wagyu, chorizo sliders. Oh, yeah, chorizo, yeah. And we've got the chicken skewers. Yeah. This is part of the main. So, they're part of the starter. That's the main. Crazy. So much food. It's very nice, though. I don't think we're going to eat all this. No. It's going to be a struggle. Give it a try. That was very good. Couldn't quite eat everything, but. No, a few little good. bits left. I've also noticed the margarine has also got the illegal tequila in. Which we think we had at Wide Bar Jaw. Yeah. I think it's the same, it must be the same one. Yeah, very similar taste. Yeah, so we'll put a link in the comments below of that video. But yeah. Yeah, that was good. Very oh, no. nice. It smells so smoky. It smells jalapeno. Yes. Yeah. That's what the weird little. We Smell of it, smells like the maybe scare me for heart. That's smoking smell. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. Can't put in, can't put it in. Definitely recommend. Just start at Leicester Square. Head into the M&M world. Let's go. This could be, this could be pudding. Oh my god. 
my god, it smells so sweet. <laughs> On the way back to the hotel, we walked past donut time. We thought we can't walk past without getting one. And they had what looks to be an Easter special. And it is the cream egg donuts. Oh, we said we couldn't fit in room for pudding. Still can't. But we couldn't resist. So we picked one up just before they closed. So we're gonna enjoy this in bed with a bit of the, I don't know, the late James, James Gordon show. James Gordon show, the late late show, I think it's <clears> called. <throat> and have a earlyish night ready for a busy day tomorrow. Tired. Yes. <laughs> so day one's done. Well, evening. Mm. Travel day. Travel. <laughs> evening. Um, but yeah, we hope you enjoyed. Uh, Stay tuned for tomorrow morning and we'll be going for some breakfast. And some Aussie breakfast. Aussie breakfast, yes. And then a day of the cursed child. Should be good fun. Stay good tuned. Morning. Good morning. Good morning. And welcome to day two of our London trip. Um, we have had a very comfortable night's stay at the Z Hotel. They're very nice. Yeah, really nice. Mm. Uh, so we got in about half past ten ish. We ate the donut. Yeah. It was very nice. Um, I fell asleep straight away. The pillows are very good. You know, we like to do a pillow talk. Um, mattress is good too. Good firm mattress, yes. Uh, I woke up about six o'clock and it was dead outside. It was lovely. So just looking mm. at the Palace Theatre in the morning with the sun shining on it was really nice and nobody outside. And I woke up at three in the morning oh. <laughs> and there was a bit of noise and yeah. motion. Some people um, still out partying. And which is what you expect in London, it never sleeps. Not it? too loud there. Um, but yeah, so we are up, we are going to head out for some breakfast uh, and then we'll head back. Our show is at two o'clock, we're doing both sittings, so we've got one at two and then one at seven, but you've got to be there 45 minutes before. Uh, obviously that's not an issue for us because we are just there. Nice and easy. So yeah, really easy for us. So I've got breakfast booked at nine. Nine o'clock. Yeah. So we are going to head out now. Uh, it is a chilly morning. Yeah, one degree. One degree is the second of April. What is going on? So yeah, come along with us, and we will go for breakfast. It does smell foodie. Good morning, London. sunny London. Let's hope it stays like this. As you can see this is the Z Hotel. It was right next to the Palace Theatre and the Cursed Child. So yeah, really good. I think that, with the are we the top top one? Not the top top. Oh okay, the one down. There. Amazing. One, two, three, yeah. Fourth one up. Oh, so I wonder who's the fifth one. Maybe that's the Queen Room. We're in a standard double. Just around the corner from the Z Hotel is the Mary Poppins show. So good location if you're coming to see this show as well. Mary Poppins. I don't know what theatre this is though. It's meant to be a good show. I know a lot of people that have been. Not oh, budget performance times. Arrived at Scarlet Green for breakfast. We've 
the yeah, I think it's the brunch menu. Is it the brunch menu? Oh, the cart menu that we're having. Um, I think. But we'll see if we find out. Oh, it's a good looking still. Yeah. Funky look inside. Hi. Hi, How are you? Good, thank you. Are you looking with us today? No. Yes, we have. Oh, sorry. We are seated in the corner of the restaurant with this cool artwork just outside. It looks like they've got seating outside as well, and then some very cool artwork dotted around. Quite a big restaurant, really. Oh yeah, it goes around that one. Isn't it? Like, that's a bit of a reflection of the bar, isn't it? I am going to go for the fancy bacon roll. The poached eggs, crispy onions, back bacon, holy fuck colonnades, so chili, half a roti, and I might add avocado, I think. Yeah. Yeah, what are you going for? The blonde Oh, yummy. Yeah. I've gone for a oat latte, and Josh went for the oat mocha. mocha. Gotta start the day with a coffee. Let's <laughs> try a bit. Good. They smell really creamy. Good art. Yum yum. Yeah, very good latte art. What you want? Food has just arrived. This is the bonsai, which looks incredible. So it's two poached eggs, charcoal sourdough, uh, and a very interesting looking sausage. Mm, I can't remember what it was. It just I can't remember what it was. Fennel or something. Ah, uh, it was. It was fennel. Was it fennel and pork? Maybe. Maybe. I guess it's pork. And then, what did I go for? I genuinely have no idea what I went for. Um, I can't remember. Oh, um, I can't remember. <laughs> the bacon roll. That was it. Bacon rolls. So it's got chilli. Fancy bacon. Yeah. The hollandaise sauce, the bacon. It looks like a waffle, lots of chilies, and I got a side avocado. So we're going to tuck in now, and Josh is already in. <laughs> Can't wait. We've just enjoyed a very oh, it's a bit, it's a bit. <laughs> oh, it's a bit. Oh, a face. Oh. We've just enjoyed a very nice breakfast at the Charlotte Green. Charlotte Green. Yeah. Um, oh, so good. Definitely recommend. Yeah. So we're gonna go walk it off now. Head to Covent Garden for a couple of yep. hours, and then head back to the hotel ready for the Coast Child. Let's go. Predicted a 20 minute walk. Say what, 10 minutes from where we were? Yeah, 10 minute walk, not even that. The other Z Hotel, the Covent Garden one, is just down here. Kind of just see it, the little sign. Just there. So they're all really close together, which is good. Um, but the main reason I chose the one for us was because of the rooftop terrace without realising how close it was to <laughs> the. Uh, Palace Theatre, so that was a happy incident. So let's go and explore Covent Garden a little bit. I do love Covent Garden, it's just so lovely. Yeah, it does. I don't know if a lot of places will open a bit later, but like 11 o'clock. It's only 10 o'clock now, isn't it? Is it 10 o'clock? Beautiful sunny Covent Garden. Go do some exploring. Yeah. See what's open inside. Yeah. Found some chocolate dipped strawberries in Godiva. It doesn't open until 11 o'clock. I wonder if a lot of places do. It's not open until 11. Yeah. I'm actually going to melt though. How does it stay in there? I don't think that's real ice cream, is it? Could be. It's real. And we've just got to the Alchemist. I'm going to try one of their cocktails. I'm going to go for alcoholic. I think I'm going to go for this. Full of changing. And Josh is going to try one of the low alcoholic ones. Non alcoholic. Non alcoholic, was it? 
and the bubble gum. Yeah. Or bubbly gum. Bubbly gum. It's got dry ice in it. And the eye meat has got dry ice such as there. So we will see. Let's see if we'll put on a little bit of a shell. Do you want to do that now? Yeah. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> wow. Really lovely. I like it to go quite crazy, that's why I put a lot of dry ice in it. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> some people like it, some people think it's messy. Yeah, I like it. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. And then was it that one? Straight. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, you're okay. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Cool. Yeah, it's big effects, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Should we take a moment and sure. try them? Yeah. yeah. Josh's is still going and mine is bubbling like a little brew. Very cool. <laughs> Door sections. This is a shop. What's the shop called? I don't know. It's just around the corner from the Palace Theatre, and obviously where we're staying. We saw it last night, but it was closed. So we thought we'd pop in. Pretty much everything Harry Potter. There is a Game of Thrones. Too. Game of Thrones, and it says Viking on the stairs. Really? Where are the Viking things? Ooh. These look familiar. So you may have seen we went to a uh, wizarding, a wizarding golf session. Yeah, wizarding weekend. In wizarding York. weekend. Yeah. So we'll link that video down below. And these are this is the prize we got. Yeah. Um, so they made in York. So yeah, so these are made in York. So that's really interesting that they've got them here as well. And then these are also what we got given. Um, the different ones. So you turn them upside down. But yeah, we'll link the video below. You can give it a watch. Got some chocolate frogs. This is cute, this newt bag. Oh, here we go. Very cool. Yeah, this little bag with the pocket. Cute. Oh, what are these? Bath potions. Oh, so these are from the potion cauldron as well. Based in York. Mm. Bath fizzes, I think. Sleep deprivation. Sleep deprivation. Hmm. I'm not sure. Some jelly. Is that jelly beans? Mm. I think we've got some candles as well. Ah. Uh -huh. The Hufflepuff section. Ravenclaw. Bits of jewellery and watches. There is, because we went to it. Was it Hamley's Toy Store? So that's where I got one of my. I got my spirit jersey from there. My Cedric Diggory one. Got a lot of these. It's on Oxford Street, isn't it? Figurines and that though, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, that's cool though, isn't it? Golden egg. Eighty-nine, ninety-nine. Oh. The bolt. Bags are cute, aren't these? Yeah. Fantastic. 
these kind of mm. creatures. I'm really pretty because the new film's coming out soon as well though, we've got a few more bits. <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> Ones in the middle. Oh, you can even get um, Hagrid's one with an umbrella. Try wizard one. We always need a magnet wherever we go. Might the occasion. This is just, just after security, so we have our bags checked and uh, bodies uh, scanned. scanned Magnetically scanned. So yeah, so we'll see what's next after this bit. So we're heading downstairs for some reason. Don't know how the yeah, I see the hinge. Hmm, it smells like a theatre. Okay, so we are in door one entry. It's up here. Alright, thank you. Are these two? 16 and 17. Good ski stuff. <laughs> well done. I told you, didn't I? First child, and that was good. Very good. Some uh, impressive effects. Yeah, really good effects. We won't obviously do any spoilers because obviously you've got to keep secret. Magic. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's mm. very good. Uh, not what I was expecting for some bits. No. Uh, some very big surprises. Uh, when you come out of theatre, there are some changes. 
mm. um, which have been done very well. Mm, yeah, very, um, very it, when the subtle. scene came up, you was like, oh, oh my goodness, look, certain things have changed. Um, mm. Yeah. So if you do go see it, make sure you're very aware of your surroundings when you come out, because uh, it's just it's just little things that they've clearly done and they've thought through very well. Um, yeah. I'm excited for part two. Yeah. So we're gonna go and get something to eat now. We did have reservation. I thought I was being organised. I booked it for the wrong time. <laughs> I thought I booked it for 4:45. I booked it for 5:45, but we've cancelled that. So we're gonna go get some Girls, chicken. What was it now? It's the oh, do not disturb. It's five it's five past five. five we've got so an we hour. yeah. So not enough time to kind of sit, sit down, down and order food, eat food. So a little takeaway. Yeah, we're just going to grab something answer. and it, obviously being here in the Z Hotel is so convenient. We didn't have to go to the toilet in there. <laughs> we were able to just run straight across and come to our own room, use the toilet. So we're going to run out, grab some food, probably come back and chill in the hotel room and then walk back across um, ready for part two, yeah. which is very exciting. Um, yeah, so we'll, let, we'll show you what we get food wise um there's lots of different little places that we've seen mm, lots of options lots of chicken around. Lots, yeah. of, uh, lots of chicken different chicken places yeah so probably some chicken yeah <laughs> <laughs> we didn't go for chicken <laughs> instead we went for pizza 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 uh, so we went to franco manca which we saw earlier this morning so yeah, this one here it's <gasps> good I don't even know what it is. Salami, caramelized onions, mm. and cheese. And That's scotch bonnet yeah, chili bonnet. dip. Which will be scarily hot. And then we went for the second one. Which chorizo. Very similar, but yeah, chorizo instead. And a garlic dip. So we're going to enjoy these. They're both sourdough pizzas as well. Yeah. Sourdough bases. So we're going to eat those and then we're going to head across to part two. They're starting to cure up already. Are they? Yeah. Oh yes, they are. It does recommend that you get there 45 minutes beforehand. We've got plenty of time. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. Some Let's pizza good. Some pizza. And you can see the theme, it's all changed. We're ready for part two. Yeah. Oh, they were saying as well, it's a different program for part two. Is it? Yeah. Slightly different cover. Ah, okay. That's quite cool. Yeah. It's really good that they changed it. Yeah. Yeah, this was all like this when we came out of part one, so it stays like this until the end, I guess. Wow, sweet. Yeah, let's have a look. And I'm down. Yeah. After coming back down, the potions have changed. The cocktails now have potions at the palette. We've all got theme. I think we're going to try them. 15 pounds. Yeah, buy one, get one half price, so why not? Serpent cocktails. Look at all of that. So the show was good. amazing. <laughs> Very good. So um, uh, uh, so I have to say, I can't really give it away. <laughs> cocktails were good. Have a cocktail. Mm, yeah, cocktails um, were good. Nibbles were good. Nibbles were good. The acting was good. Yeah. So we're gonna go and eat the rest of the pizza. It's the next day. You can see it's the next day. Yeah. <laughs> the pizza's already. <laughs>